Hey guys, this is Bola, and today in this tutorial, I will show how we can generate controls for the rig of our character using Mixmo Blender add-on, and how we can combine multiple animations easily. So, hope you guys will find the video useful. So, I'll keep a target of 50 likes for this video. Please help me to achieve the target. Now, without any further delay, let's start today's tutorial. So, here I'm using Blender 4.5.3 version. Okay. So, first of all, come to this GitHub page. I will leave a link in the description. So come to this code options and download this zip file. This is Mixmo Blender add-on. So first we need to install this one. And later here I will be using this character from Sketchfab. So I have downloaded this character and I have uploaded this character into Mixamo. So I'll get some animations here. So first of all, I will show you how to install this add-on. After downloading this zip file, come to Blender. So here, let me clear the scene. Now go to this edit preferences come to this add-ons here click on this small drop down arrow install from disk so here i got the add-on so simply select it and install from disk it will be installed let us save those preferences so if i press n on the keyboard you will get this mixamo add-on okay so now let's import our character so here i'm using this spider-man character right so i have uploaded this to mixamo and i got some animations one animation with the skin and other animations without skin that means we will get the skeleton only so now let's import our spider-man character here with walking animation so go to this file option import i have downloaded in fpx so fpx so here i got the walking animation so select it we got the spider-man character and it got the animation walking animation so here i want to loop this animation so let's select the armature place cursor on the timeline and press a to select all the keyframes now press shift plus e and make it cyclic so now if i play this we will have this walking animation looping throughout the timeline but here you can say the position is getting changed so now we need to fix this one we want this character to be walking continuously in this y-axis so for that let's change this to graph editor okay so here we got this keyframes right now select any of the keyframe here so here i have selected this keyframe now come to this modifier and after mode change this to repeat with offset so now click on this copy modifier option now place the cursor on the timeline, press A to select all the keyframes. Now paste it and expand these options and click on this replace existing. So now if I move on to the timeline and if I play this from here, you can see our character will be moving forward throughout the timeline along this Y axis. Nice. So if you increase this timeline to 500, this character will be moving throughout the timeline till 500 frames okay you can see we got this character moving throughout the timeline till 500 frames nice so now here i want to add another animation onto this armature so first of all let's generate control rig for this so let's come to the starting frame select the armature press n on the keyboard here we got this mixamo add-on right click on that so here being selected the armature of our character click on this create control rig and make sure to enable all these options and ok so now you can see we got this controllers added so if i play this we will get this controllers and if you want to manually change the animation you can do the changes to pose mode select any controller and you can change the animation of the character and by any chance if you want to add your own animation you can do that so for that let's change this to object mode here you can see right zero outrig if you click that one animations will go out now you can manually edit or add animations of your choice so i will undo this one so now here i want to add multiple animations onto the same controller so first of all let me change this first action so here i will change this to walking and say this now let's change this to non-linear animation so here you can see we got this walking right so first click on this drop down action button so now this is converted to a strip now i want to add another animation for this character so here i will import another animation with skeleton so here i got this flip animation and here i don't want to loop this animation so first of all let me get this animation onto our character so let's select this control rig and 
select this eyedropper and click on this armature and apply animation to control rig so now this character will have that animation acquired okay so now let's convert this animation into a strip in order to use both walking and flip animations so let's change this to non-linear animation and here i will change this to flip and here you can see we got this push down button right click on this push down button we we'll get an action strip created here so this action strip has this flip animation and here it should have this walking animation but this is staying still and change this to nothing now select this action strip and also change this to nothing so now we will have this walking animation and later we will get the flip but here we need to adjust so let me hide out this armature so select and hide it out so now we got both the animations but the position of our character is shifting so first of all let's blend this animation so let's select this second strip and let's give some value here blending value so now you can see it is blending now we need to adjust the position so let's select the character so this is the position right make sure to note the position so it is at the line so this walking animation is ending at this line so be on that line add keyframe for this location okay so now move one frame forward and let's see where it blends properly so come to this position and let's bring our character here and add location keyframes so now if i play this you will have a perfect sync of both animations so in this way we can use mixamo rig add-on to get animations onto our character easily so hope you guys have learned something new from this tutorial if you have learned anything new please like share and subscribe to this channel to support me so we'll meet in the next video until then signing off take care bye